Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how to fix this problem, which happens usually on old motherboards. The first solution will be to bypass this problem and the next solution will be to completely remove this problem. So uh, let's start. But let me first explain to you why this error has happened. You see, on every motherboard you have boot disk ports and data disk ports. The data disk ports are black in this case, on this motherboard. And the boot disk ports are red. In this case, the SATA cable is connected to a black disk port and because of that we have that problem with with booting this PC and uh, let me now show you how you can bypass this problem and uh, in the end I will show you how to completely remove this error when starting the computer type delete or add to enter BIOS. Also, F1. Here in the BIOS, go to boot and boot settings configuration. Here, you need to set this option wait for f1 if error which is enabled in, in this case set it to disabled exit save and exit changes And the Windows is starting normally. That is the first option and the bypass. That is the bypass option. Now I'm going to show you how to completely remove the problem. Okay. Let's now completely remove the problem. As you have seen, I have set the SATA cable to a red boot disk port from a black data disk port. And now when we will start the computer, the problem will be completely gone. If this thing happens, like now, when the system doesn't want to boot, press restart and everything will be okay.
you see now no error is detected again the system will boot normally now thank you guys for watching subscribe to the channel and see you in the next video bye